Well, lending a helping hand, that's what a church on St. Simon's Island is doing tonight. With folks struggling to find or afford, or afford essential items like toilet paper and bread, this church has come up with a pretty creative way to help. Alex Ositis went to talk with them, and he spoke with the pastor who's leading the way. My hope is also perhaps someone saw it and that it maybe inspired them to think creatively or outside of the box about the ways they could be a good neighbor during the unique time and circumstances that we are in. Pastor Tony Langford is used to tending to his flock at First Baptist Church of St. Simon's Island, but when the word spread around that there were people in need of essentials like bread and rolls of toilet paper, he and his congregants came up with an idea. We had just gotten a shipment, a big box of toilet paper, and a we have extra and folks need some. I think we have a sacred responsibility to share. Normally there are free books in this little library fashioned to look like the 72 year old sanctuary, but in a time of need, the contents have shifted. Langford says it's a tough time, particularly so close to Easter, a time when the pews are filled. Now he's leading services online. It's different, he says, but something everyone will need to get used to for a while. We've had a uh, People who may not normally join us in worship, join us in worship. This past week, I got emails from or communication from people from four different states. In the meantime, they're doing their best to roll with the changes. And all that starts with staying true to their mission, taking care of one another. But hopefully it's helped us refocus on who the church is called to be, not just the building that we go and enter into on Sundays, but the place from which we go and then serve out in our communities. Reporting, Alex Ositis, First Coast News, on your side.